Am I on? Okay. Hi, everyone. Hi. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? So, let's do a general read, guys. Let's do a general read. This is going to be a collective read, guys. It's just collective, so this is going to be for whoever needs it, okay? So, if you're new to the channel, come on in, y'all. Come on in so you can, uh, don't miss out on the future videos. Click the subscribe button, click that bell to get the notifications, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's talk. Come on. Because I just got a feeling like, I just got a feeling that this is about to be juicy. I just got that feeling. Let's do a collective read, guys. So let's see for the remainder of September what is coming towards my collective, okay? So it's going to be for who needs it. Just a general message, okay? So, spirit ancestors and we need um truth light energy please give me some light energy we got the nine of cups wanting to jump out wish fulfillment baby <laughs> wish fulfillment okay and then we got the justice card oh okay and we got the ten of cups oh then we got the four of wands and the empress there's some type of offer okay is does somebody want to get married oh my goodness what 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 is this wow i'm getting that somebody wants to get married or move in or but I'm definitely getting a marriage. Legally married here with the Ten of Cups and the Four of Wands. This is your twin flame energy. This could definitely be your twin flame. But this is taking things to the next level. But then the Empress came out right after that. Okay? So I'm getting like a wife or a husband. Someone's. Oh, let's just go ahead. Let's just get into it. Let's just get into it because. What other messages is there? Now, we just saw the empress. Now, we have the emperor. Okay? So, let's see how this ties together. Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But nonetheless, this is such a beautiful energy. This is such a beautiful energy. Someone possibly wants to be like your man or wants to like be that the emperor to you or the empress i'm just getting that yeah this person could have possibly i'm getting like somebody is choosing you look we got this seven of cups the three of swords okay oh the devil the queen of wands okay and the two of pentacles all right so somebody here was doing some juggling okay somebody here had a lot of options a lot going on right and it looks with the page of cups this is like a really small offer okay and uh i'm getting that also the page of cups is also like flirtatious energy like you know messages of you know flirting so i'm getting like maybe your person was flirting around or messing around you know just playing around with people but i'm getting like someone here has come to their senses and it's like you know what i want a real thing i want the real thing here oh because we got the queen of cups here okay queen of cups her energy is so caring and her energy is so caring and nurturing like this is let me see what else we get Yes, somebody wants to work on something with you. The three of pentacles. 
somebody wants to work on this with you. Somebody wants to build with you. Somebody wants to bring this together like it used to be. The Six of Cups. What? Oh, the Three of Cups coming back together, reuniting. They hope that you still care, that you still love them. This is, you may be at a distance from this person with the Six of Swords, or this person feels like you're, you've moved on. Oh, and they know that you have your guard up. They know that they messed up. And, oh, they want to come back and work on this, okay? So let's look at the past energy. Thank you. Yeah, the Knight of Cups. There's this offer. I'm getting like somebody wants you to accept the offer. Yeah, because look at this. They know they made the, they made a bad decision. Okay? They know what they did because we got the Five of Cups and the Temperance. So now they want to balance this out. They want to heal this connection. Okay? Um, I'm feeling like they're moving towards you. We got the Magician and the Fool. So, they're willing to take risk, okay? They're willing to take a risk with you. Past energy. Oh, okay, we'll clarify that. But let me see what's coming ahead. Ooh. This person could feel... This person could have some um, financial issues. Um... And we got the hangman, which is Pisces' is energy as well. Lots of, I'm getting Pisces. Lots of water here with the Knight of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the hangman. But they're waiting uh, to possibly to get themselves together financially. So this could be something that they're working on before they, you know, come to you and express everything they don't want to come empty-handed and they don't want you to feel like okay see we got the four of cups the four of cups and the page of wands so they're not telling you their financial situations they're not telling you that this could be their energy that they actually you know are working on their finances ten of pentacles okay so this person could be working on their finances but they're tired of um, you know, you not being in the loop, you're not being in the circle of knowing what they have going on, them not knowing what you got going on. Because that intuition is telling them that you're to the point now where you will move on. You will, you'll leave. You will leave. Wow, okay. How does this person feel currently? Yes, this person is not letting you go. They're not going to let you get away. Four of Pentacles. They're not going to let you get away. Mm -mm. You ain't about to get away that easy. Yes, because they look at you as the Empress and the Four of Wands and the Ten of Cups. And I'm telling you, somebody here is married. They've been separated. Or something to that nature. And somebody is ready to. Somebody's ready to work this out. Or take things to the next level. They not letting you go. They look at you as the empress. Okay. This could most definitely be your twin flame. With the four of wands. They look at you as their twin flame. They look at you as their, their soulmate, their perfect match. They not letting you go. Ooh, we got the devil. Okay, so you could you view this person as the devil. <laughs> this could be a Capricorn. But you view this person as the devil. Like, you feel like they're, you know, possessive. They're obsessive. They have a lot of nasty habits. Um, you just look at this person in a negative light, okay? And I feel like you aren't, you're not, 
you're not moving, you're not charging ahead, not yet. Okay, you're not charging ahead. Like you have to, I don't feel like you fully let your guard down because there's been some, you know, some five of wands energy. There's been some disagreements. This person just, you know, had a lot going on. And here you are, you're focused on you. You're bettering yourself. You on your glow up. You're doing what you need to do for you. Mm-hmm. You're doing what you need to do. So you're you I feel like your guard is up. What is this person hopes or fears? The ace of wands and the seven of cups. Okay, so I'm getting like they want a new start with you. They want a new start. They want you to give them a chance. But I feel like they are afraid that you may not choose them or you may not accept their offer. Because I got the Six of Pentacles, okay, and the Seven of Cups. They may want you to give them an ultimatum. I'm getting that as well. Like, if you give them the ultimatum and say, hey, if, you know, if you want to be with me, then this is what I require. I feel like they would actually be like, okay, all right, let's do it. Let's do this. What is this outcome going to be? Show me the outcome to this situation, this beautiful situation. It looks so beautiful. Thank you. We got the strength card, okay? So there could be Leo's energy. I got the Aquarius energy with the star card, the five of swords, and the and the five of cups. They hope that you forgive them for every for all of the everything that they put you through. Look, the tower for their messed up decisions. Okay, it's like this person is really crying over spilled milk. Like, do you have the courage? Do you have the courage to forgive me and all of my flaws? I'm getting it. Let's do some clarifying. I do want to clarify the Knight of Cups because I do want to see what this offer is. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Okay, they're waiting for you to give them an answer or give them some type of... They're waiting for you to give them some type of offer. Or they're wondering if you will accept... This is what it is. They're wondering... If you will accept this small offer, okay? Because I feel like this person doesn't have what they feel like um, you deserve. But they want this. They want to work on it. Yeah, they don't know. They don't know if you'll accept their, uh, you know, accept what they're telling you. You know, I feel like they came towards you and expressed their feelings. And like, they was waiting on a response from you. Um, they didn't know how you, you know, how you were going to respond or react to it. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? The Star card, yeah. See, they had hope that, okay, yeah, I feel like they had hope that you'll close this chapter and, you know, let it go. And, and they're hoping that you were would let it go and just forgive them. Forgive them and heal, okay? So... I feel like they opened up. That's what this Knight of Cups energy was here for. Like, they opened up and expressed their regrets, okay, about their decisions, okay? They made some They made some bad decisions, and they're, they're dealing with it right now. But on the other end, they're hoping, they still have a hope that, you know, can we just close this chapter? Can we just, you know, I need to get this off my chest. Can we just please close this chapter, okay? Can, would you forgive me? Can, can we heal from this and move forward type of energy? Okay, so why is the Three of Pentacles here? Why is the Three of Pentacles here? Yeah, see, they want to work out their issues with you. Yeah, mm-hmm. We got the Five of Wands. Okay, and the Three of Pentacles, they want to work these. They want to work through you guys' issues, okay? They do want to work through this because they feel like you slipping away. And they're like, uh-uh. Eight of Swords and the Six of Swords. The Eight of Swords is someone that's trapped, stuck, and mental or physically like, you know, you know, I got you right where I want you. 
But then with that six of swords here, they say, uh-uh, because I can move right on around that. Let me show you. And that's what y'all been doing. Y'all been moving around this person, like, mm, everything, they, every trap that they done set for you, you like, er, 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 <laughs> You ain't finna get me. You not about to get me. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Wow. Why is the emperor here? Okay, so we got the death card and the king of wands. Okay, so this emperor energy could be another person as well. This could be like a baby father because you know this is the father energy. Maybe they want to see if you, uh, you know, maybe they want to see if there's someone else in the picture. Okay, because they feel like you're not, maybe they asked you something and they feel like you aren't telling the truth. Because I got the Ten of Swords and the Ace of Swords. Somebody here is working on something or building something. Eight of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. Working diligently on something. I feel like this is them wanting to work on this. But they, they it's a trust factor now. Now it's a trust factor. With the Death Card, this is an ending and transformation as well. But then we got that King of Wands. You could be dealing with, there could be an Aries in the picture. But they feel like, let me see, I want to see. Give me more information about the Emperor. The Sun card could be Leo. Okay, no, this is, could be a baby father. Because I got the Six of Cups. Okay, so this is possibly like they are wondering. They want to know if you're dealing with someone from your past. Um, this is, you know, the children card as well. This is my children card in this deck. Okay, so I'm getting like a baby father. Maybe they want to know if you, you know are messing with messing around with a baby father or is there an older man there could be an older man or just another person in general like they want to know why is the nine of cups here okay they want you to make up your mind if you want them or not so they may feel like you got another person in the picture Mm-hmm. because we got the lovers and a seven of cups so they want you to choose between them and this emperor energy i'm getting like could be like a leo or aries or a sagittarius um it could be any sign for that matter but the emperor is definitely father like energy or an older man or just a man that's about his business okay they're trying to see what you got going on why is the four of pentacles here? This person is still very much so attached to you and holding on to you most definitely. The hermit. Hermit. Something here about taking their time. They're trying to take their time to find out. They're trying to find out something. They're trying to find out something. They want to know what's going on between you and another person are you seeing someone else i'm getting king of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn knight of pentacles capricorn's energy i'm keep getting a marriage here maybe they want to know if you've been with someone during the separation maybe some of y'all have been separated they want to know who you've been seeing during the separation because now they want to come back because this is them rushing back in Okay, this is them rushing back in. And then I see as well, too, they're spying on you. Okay. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Is this sexual energy? Why is the Ace of Wands here? The Justice card. <laughs> now they're thinking about karma. <laughs> but... I feel like also with the Ace of Pentacles and the Hierophant, they want, they, I feel like they want, um, they want a new start with you, but I keep getting a sense of there is a marriage here, like, there is a marriage, and I feel like they want to start new, they want to work on this, they want to put some effort in, but I feel like after a period of them being gone, like, them being away from you. Yeah, like I see the relationship could have possibly ended. Someone said that the rela a relationship ended. 
maybe they uh, cut someone off to come back to you. Because I got the Knight of Wands. Ooh, and King of Wands. Mm-hmm. Somebody was playing. Mm-hmm. Yes, I'm getting it. Why is the strength card here? The three of cups. Do you have the courage and the strength? Are you bold enough to come back with me? Are you bold enough to come back together and make this work? I'm getting I know that I got to. I know what I got to do. And I keep getting that there's a marriage or someone who's living together or this is your twin flame and y'all have been in the runner chaser stage. But this is definitely like coming back home. Mm-hmm. 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 They're disappointed in themselves because they know they messed up with you. Okay. They know that they tore this down, but now they want a new start. All right. It's so funny because you look at this person as the devil. <laughs> you look at this person as the freaking devil. Let's see what they want to say to you. What does this person want to say to my collective? What does this person want to say to my collective? Okay. What does this person want to say to? Ooh. Have you moved on? I'm worried. Have you moved on? I'm so worried. Are you gone? Is you gone? Then I tell y'all that. <laughs> okay. I'm quiet to protect you from my ego. So this person may, you know, try to keep quiet on certain things because they're afraid of their ego coming out and them, you know, answering questions based off of their ego or coming at you in a very egotistical way. <sighs> Will you wait for me? I can't let go of the past. <laughs> we are on hold, but I'm coming back for you what I told you they coming back they coming will you wait for me <laughs> one more thank you I'm ignoring other people <laughs> Ah, this person said it. Look, I'm ignoring everybody. I don't cut cut this person off. I'm ignoring everybody because I'm coming back to be with you. <laughs> Have you moved on? They so worried that y'all done moved on. So y'all been you been away from this person or separated from this person for a while, and now they want to come back because they probably feel like you moved on. They done heard about you being with somebody else. They, you know they feeling they type of way or whatever. <laughs> okay Let's see what the romance angels have to say What messages do you have for my collective In their person Oh <laughs> Ah Okay all right, so, mm, oh, guys, oh, <laughs> okay, see, so yeah, there was definitely a separation, I feel like this is someone from your past that wants to come back, and I feel like they're coming back for um, forgiveness, okay, they want you to forgive them. They are possibly going to come towards you, wanting to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation about what happened what was said and what was done okay because they want to definitely reconcile okay reconciliation and also i feel like they're trying to get you to trust them again okay because they know they messed up your trust 
But definitely, we got healing family issues. So they most definitely, you know, want to heal. Okay? But let's talk about, that was just at the bottom of the deck. Let's talk about what did come out. All right, so we got passion, okay? So this person wants to get in bed with you. They want to do the whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> they want to get it on, okay? They want to use this to, you know, get you to let your guard down so they can have that heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you and get you to trust them again, okay? They've been calling you in. We got calling in your soulmate. They possibly have been doing, visualizing you, they probably been manif manifesting you back into their reality. You know, they possibly been looking at your pictures. They possibly been thinking of you, um, you know, all the time. All the time until they just manifest their way back into your life. But this person definitely feels like you're their soulmate. Okay? They feel like you're their soulmate. So, boo boo. What y'all gonna do? <laughs> what y'all gonna do? What are y'all gonna do? Okay, so let's do these cards real quick. Let's see what we get from here. What message do you have for the collective, please? Okay. Observer, they're watching you. They're spying on you. And I had already said that. And we got material world here as well, too. We got recognition. They recognize your worth. They're thinking about you, too. Nostalgia. Give me one more card. Union. Look at that. And look. They feel they want you. They want your understanding. Okay, they want you to be understanding. <laughs> okay, so like I said, we got observers. So they're observing the hell out of you. They're watching you. Okay, they're watching you like a hawk. Period. If you got a social media account and your friends, or even if you're not friends with them, they are watching you. Okay, they probably got other people watching you. We got material world. Like they, I feel like this comes into play with they know your worth. I do want to see what I'm. Let me get a clarifier. Material world. Material world. Why is material world here? Give me a clarifier. Yeah, the Page of Pentacles, like I said. And I feel like the Page of Pentacles is saying that the, you know, this person could be penny pitching. Okay, I feel like this person's money isn't where they want it to be or how they feel. They feel like you deserve more. Okay, and they probably feel like, you know, you're not just going to accept anything. Give me another clarifier. The sun. Mm -hmm. But see the four of pentacles So they're trying to save their money Or they're holding on to their money Okay Yeah they're trying to balance They're trying to keep a balance on their money Okay so this person may need help Financially Okay Yeah the page of pentacles Came right back out And, and see the two of swords here The two of swords They may have not been doing the right thing with their money with the ace of pentacles they haven't been doing the right thing with their money i don't know if they have been overspending or they're using putting their money in the wrong places or you know everybody's kind of like going through the ups and downs of this pandemic right now but their money is looking kind of funny okay their money is looking funny so maybe you know they want to talk to you about that okay but they're definitely thinking about the past like they're having you know being nostalgic having nostalgic moments about you okay like i'm getting like this person thinks about you all the time yes the three of wands like you know i'm just waiting i'm just waiting on this i'm waiting on them i can't wait to see them i can't wait to hold them i can't wait to touch them oh the lovers and the three of wands 
They can't. It's like they're waiting for you guys to come back together. Yes, the hangman. Okay, they've been waiting. It's been on hold for a minute. I feel like this. You guys may have been separated from this person or broke up with this person like a while ago, and now here they come, wanting to bring peace to the situation, wanting to bring positive energy into this situation. Yeah, and and like I said, they want to talk about money. Okay, I feel like they want to. Possibly, like, you may be a better, um, you may be better with money or you help this person, you know, get their money together or something like that. They may be, like, a, like I said, like an overspender or something like that. But with nostalgia, they're just thinking about, you know, how y'all used to do things in the past, okay? We got recognition. So there's something that they recognize, and I feel like they recognize that you are their twin flame that you are their soulmate or you are you know the person that they want to be with they now recognize that if they didn't before they do now why is recognition here they regret yeah look at this five of cups and the seven of swords they regret what they did whatever they did whether it was lying cheating stealing whatever whatever they did they recognize what the fuck they did wrong. They know exactly what it is that they did wrong. They know what they did. They know exactly what they did. Yup. Started drama. Started an argument. Started. They recognize what they did wrong. Okay. I'm getting that. This was real, real messed up. Like, they did you real, real messed up. Real messed up. And then we got a union here. So, like... Yes, but they feel like they don't. I feel like they don't. Um, they don't know if you're going to accept their offer. They don't know if you're going to accept this offer. They hope you do. They have faith that you will. You know, they have faith. They've been praying on it. They've been praying about this. Um, but they, I feel like they, they aren't that confident. They aren't that that conf that confident. Yeah. See, look. The nine of cups in the world. Look. They want to close this chapter. Yeah. It's like, I'm getting like, I'm done with this. My old ways. So, y'all got a decision y'all got to make. Yeah. Waiting on them to come back. Y'all got a decision that y'all got to make. Because whether you like it or not, here this person come. Here this person come. Let's see what the angels have to say. All right. This is exciting news for people that do want their person to come back. Um, you know, if you feel like it's worth it, go for it. But if you feel like this person is full of shit, then mm -mm. let's see what the angels have to say. Don't stop. That sounds kind of freaky. <laughs> Big happy changes. Remain positive. Romance. Ask your angels. All right. <laughs> oh, if you believe. Oh, if you believe big happy changes, you're going to get this, you know, this. Look, we got yes. A year from now. Okay, give me one more card. Trust. So I feel like it's going to, ooh, look at abundance sitting down here. Abundance and romance. Success. Okay. All right, I like these three cards. I like these. I like these three cards here. I like those. Success, abundance, and romance. I like that. But the first card we got here is don't stop. Don't stop. Get it. Get it. Don't stop. <laughs> we got don't stop. Big happy changes. And if you believe. Like I'm just. I like this vibe. Like the vibe is like on point. On 10. 10. 
Like the angels, like, well, if you feel like, just like what I said before I even pulled the cards, if you feel like it, that this person has changed or you feel like, you know, it's time, then go for it. Why is don't stop here? Yeah, we got the four of swords. Ooh. That page of pentacles again. Yeah, see, the six of pentacles. And then here this person come telling you this person come in full force. Okay? I don't. I'm not trying to be funny, but I'm just getting like, this could be like sexual energy. I'm just, I'm just being honest. I'm just getting, being honest the way it looks. I'm just being honest. We got the four swords in the page of pentacles. So this could be like somebody's laying down. Why is the page of pentacles here? I don't really want to say it because I don't, I don't want to say it on this video, but, you know. Yeah, like the past. Like, do it how you used to do it. <laughs> we going to leave that alone. But I still feel like the energy is good there. Big happy changes. Ooh, ooh. Okay. This person is wants to be taken very seriously with that King of Swords. Okay, I feel like this person possibly was giving you cold hearted energy um before, but they done doing that shit now. And the Queen of Swords. And the King of Swords, you probably was giving this person the same energy back. We got the Ace of Cups. Okay, so yeah, somebody was cold-hearted. Queen of Swords and the Ace of Cups, this is saying I'm done being cold-hearted. They were possibly being very cold-hearted to you too. We got Page of Swords again. They was watching you. Why is if you believe here? So this person has changed their perspective. Yeah, see, if you believe we got the five of pentacles and the ten of swords, this is somebody who's, you know, is in a real messed up situation, okay? If you feel like you want to help this person out, you know, this person possibly is coming to you, you know, banged up, banged up and bruised up, okay? Um, and you possibly have gotten, you know, you're, you progressed, you've moved forward since then, um, you know, you've moved forward, but they're still kind of stuck. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Five of Swords, yeah. See, they don't want to, they don't want to be in this Five of Swords energy with you anymore. Like, they want to come out of that. And they're, they're telling the truth. Like, they are coming towards you like, hey. You got my full undivided attention. You know what I'm saying? Let's talk through this. They want to talk. Why is yes here? <laughs> we got the full card. Yes, go for it. Okay? For some of you, not all of you. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to tell someone that's in a domestic violence or this person was abusive or this person, you know, was just doing the most. But if it's something that you have forgiven and can get past... Then this person coming back, like I said, could be a good thing. Yeah, they want to definitely close a chapter, something that they had going on in the past. Why is a year from now here? A year from now. We got the Four of Pentacles and the Empress and the Knight of Swords. I'm getting mother and children energy as well. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? The Queen of Wands. Why is the Queen of Wands here? I keep getting a marriage. The Justice card and the Ten of Cups. Why is the Queen of Wands here? I'm trying to get as much information as I can. Okay. This person, I'm getting a year from now, there could be somebody from their past trying to resurface. 
somebody who hasn't let go coming towards you and trying to, you know, bring up old stuff. Because I'm getting that there could possibly be like some shocking news, the Tower and the Page of Wands. But this person going to tell, tell they asses straight up. The Emperor and the Two of Cups. I'm in a relationship now. I got, or I'm in this marriage. Um, quit trying to, you know, let me go. Let me go. But I'm feeling like somebody from their past may try to resurface. We got trust here. This is where the trust factor is going to come in. The world. Okay. So this person's going to feel like you don't trust me. There may, there's, I guarantee you. There's going to be somebody coming from the past that's going to try to bring up some old stuff. Mm-hmm. The hermit and the high priestess. Yeah. Like, why is the world here? Five of cups. They going to, they, they, oh, they messed up bad. Why is the five of cups here? And the four of wands again. Okay. And I'm getting like somebody told the truth that they were married or living with somebody or this person is my soulmate. I love this person. Like maybe you told this other person that, but they just can't let it go. We got the strength card. Could be a Leo. Um, yeah, see, the two of swords and seven cups trying to convince them that they didn't make a good decision. Um, they're trying to figure out if the love is still there, if this person still cares. Okay. Mm-hmm. Somebody going to be trying to come in. Yeah. For some of you, this is definitely a marriage. Ten of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. So this could be the thing. Like, yeah, see, somebody's trying to get somebody to leave or walk away from the marriage or a living arrangement or you two guys coming together and taking things to the next level. Yeah, see, somebody will be celebrating if you were to walk away, okay? From some from your husband. I keep getting husband. The Hierophant and the King of Cups. They want to see if the love is strong. Oh, your relationship strong? Let's see. Let's see how strong it is. Uh-huh. They could be upset because your person didn't choose them. We got the strength card. Okay. Leo. That could be a Leo person coming in and doing this. They can see that your person ain't paying them no attention no more. And they like, uh, uh, me? They did that to me? Child, let it go. Let it go. All right. So that's going to be the message that I have for you guys. Y'all chime in and let me know what's going on. Well, you know what? Before I do that, before I leave, I want to put for the Kipper deck because I want to know about this other person. This other person that's going to try to come back in a year from now. So they're going to try to, they sitting back and wait for a whole year to come and try to tell, tell down what y'all got. On, or try to intervene show me this other person's intentions show me the other person's intentions towards my collective yeah the coffin yep main male and this is like the death card okay so <laughs> they trying to dead that situation they trying to get y'all to yeah false person mm-hmm False person. And then I got great fortune here and unexpected income. They could be trying to reel your person in with money. Okay. They could be trying to reel your person in with money. Courthouse. Concern. I'm going to clarify. Courthouse. Pathway. And the lovers. Yeah. Um, for some of you, this could be like a long distance relationship. In a family room. Someone's family may like them. Their family may like this person. So that's their way in. As well as they could be giving your person, helping your person out financially, like giving this person money. They can try to reel them in by using that. Okay, we got concern. Yeah, family. So somebody's family is concerned about this false person. 
and then we got courtship and children okay i'm not sure if this could be a baby mother or a baby father that's trying to do this okay or they have ties with uh your person's ch child or children because we got child right here okay so i wanted to pull a few clarifiers especially for for coughing they're trying to get y'all to end this why is coughing here yep five pentacles mm -hmm. they could be feeling rejected or left out in the cold because like i said the person's your person's final decision was to be with you they ran back to you okay false person who is this false person knight of cups see this person um may be coming back to apologize to your person um but somebody here two of pentacles and a seven of swords this person is definitely a false person this person comes to bring confusion okay why is the knight of cups here Ooh, uh -huh, the sun card Okay, it could be a Leo. I keep getting Leo's energy. Um, but yeah, like moved on to something better. Okay, I'm getting like somebody saying I moved on to something better. Or this person could come to your person and ask them, do they need anything? Do, can you need anything? Do you need anything? Why is the sun card here? The Knight of Pentacles, like I said, giving them little, they trying to reel them in. This is their plan. This is something that they thought of that they feel like this person is in need of. Um, and they're creeping in, like they're creeping in, um, trying to bait your person. See if your person, if this is going to get them, is that the crack? Is that the crack that they can get in to try to destroy what is being built between y'all? Yep, the magician and the king of pentacles. Yep, they know that this makes your person run to them. Then this makes their your person come back because I feel like this is, to uh, be honest, I feel like this is your person's energy. Like they um, don't have much. They don't have much. Yep, they're they're baiting them, want them to come back. They're baiting your person. Why is the courthouse here? King of Cups, Eight of Cups. Okay, somebody walked away. Somebody got tired and walked away. So your person could have got tired and walked away from this person. Why well, is the King of Cups here? Oh, somebody was manipulating somebody's. Somebody's manipulating somebody's feelings. Played with somebody's feelings. Ooh. Queen of Pentacles and a Page of Swords. Page of Swords and the Moon. Oh, there's definitely a spy. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn could be involved. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But there's definitely this person spying. Spying, spying, spying. They feel like this, they feel like your person could have lied about how they felt. Why is the Seven of Swords here? Queen of Swords. Yeah, and they're cold hearted. They're cold. Because your person moved on to another opportunity. Halfway. The Empress. The, somebody's mother could be involved. Or somebody's sister. Or somebody. A feminine energy could be helping this person. Make these moves. Because they're trying to get your person to be this King of Wands energy. They could be trying to have sex with your person. Like, they're trying to reel your person back in. I keep getting it. They might even call your person while they at work. Multiple times. Why is the Empress here? Ooh. The Moon. Oh, this is a side piece energy for sure, for sure. Um... What is the moon energy here? Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune. This their chance to sneak in. This their chance to sneak in. Strength card again. Some of y'all definitely, this is a Leo um, doing this, possibly, most definitely. Two of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But it's like somebody not sure if this person is bold enough or, see, like I said, I'm getting like they want to be the side piece. They're okay with being on the side. The Two of Pentacles and the Three of Swords. This is definitely 
side piece energy, especially with the Empress and the Moon. Three of Pentacles, right up under that. Threes. Okay, so we got concerns. Yep, Four of Wands. And this is concern. The family could be involved, or somebody is saying, oh, you know, mm -mm, I got this going on. We good. Page of Swords. They've been watching. They're sitting back watching. Watch Four of Wands. They watching to see when it's all going to crumble down or how it's going to go down. Page of Wands. Or this person is keeping in communication with your family. And somebody may tell them that this person don't have their resources or they might need some help financially. The Death and the Ten of Pentacles. Capricorn energy. The Devil. Queen of Pentacles. So this person like, oh, well, I got it. Why is courtship here? Three of Cups. Three of Cups. They want to be part. They want to be <laughs> involved. Why is the Three of Cups here? They may even ask for a three. I'm just saying. That's how they act. The Eight of Wands. And the Temperance. I'm getting somebody's telling somebody's business. I'm getting hope you're ready for the truth to come out. See, this your person gonna have to be careful. Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Swords and the Fool. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody. This person with the Three of Cups, like, they want to come back together with this person so bad. Like, they may have been telling their friends, talking to their friends about it, and um, trying to figure out how to stay in the mix. The Nine of Swords, this person is worried um, about, you know, about kind of, like, taking a risk, but they're willing to do it. Monster World card here. Justice. They feel like this could be karma or they're trying to get somebody to divorce with the three of swords and the justice card. Keeping drama going, okay? This person loves this. They love it. Two of pentacles in the tower. They love it. They want y'all to slip up. Mm -hmm. So... It seemed like y'all person got involved with like a crazy psycho. So y'all got, I'm glad that this came out because I want y'all to look at this and make the best decision, okay? So y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. If you want to book a personal reading, guys, that information to contact me is going to be in the drop box below. All right, you can just email me and my team will get back to you on booking your own personal reading with me. Um, as well, guys, if you want to order the Money Magnet Oil, the Money Magnet Oil is sold out um, over the last two weeks, but I did just make a new batch and it'll be available um, next week. So if you want to pre-order, um, you can contact me via email as well and we can get you set up for the pre-order and make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. All right. Ciao.